Hey, Katrina here from Scrappy Horses. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm so happy you're here. This video is sort of a part two, um, and I'm showing you on screen right now where I actually put the silhouette together to put on the keychain in Cricut Design Space. If you are interested in that, you can see the YouTube video. I'll also put a tab card up in the right hand corner so you can go check that out. I'm gonna move right on into making this keychain. I am starting with some decoupage matte glue or sealer. And what I'm going to do is once I peel the backing off of this little circle, I am going to just with a paintbrush paint the decoupage sealer or glue onto this. Now I will tell you that the hardest part of this whole thing is getting that little backing strip off. How that was hard. All right, next I'm sprinkling some chunky glitter and all of these materials will be listed below. I let it dry and I repeat. So here we go again. This is layer two, more decoupage glue, more chunky glitter, wipe off the sides and let it dry overnight. Now I'm gonna come in and I'm going to seal this with some triple thick Brilliant Brush on Gloss Glaze. This is from Deco Art and I'm showing you there with that red arrow that the sparkles are still coming off the keychain. So as you can see, I'm pouring this into another container. I am not dipping my brush directly into my uh, jar of this triple thick gloss. I put it in a separate little uh, lid. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put another coat of this over the back and that's gonna seal in any of that glitter. And so no more glitter is going to come off after this point. It also gives it a really fun high gloss uh, appearance as well as sealing everything in. All right, it's time to take a look at our vinyl cut that we created. Again, if you need help with that, the other video is available and it is linked below and you can see how we created this die cut. I'm gonna go ahead and weed away the bits of vinyl that we don't need, and that leaves us just with our little silhouette. Again, I'm gonna pick away at this liner to get it off. That really is the hardest part of this project. I picked away right there by where the uh, keychain was going to go, and that made it a little simpler, and if I scratched it a little bit, it wouldn't matter because the keychain was gonna go ahead and cover that. A little tip for placing on your vinyl, I place on the thinnest part first of the heart and then rub as I go on the thicker parts of the cut. Now I'm gonna come in with that triple thick gloss and I'm gonna do a layer over the front. Again, I'm just gonna use a paintbrush and just paint right over and that's gonna seal this piece of vinyl in and give it a really high gloss look. We're gonna go ahead and let that front dry and we're gonna go ahead and coat the back again. Now I will say that as we do this, we want to come in and make sure that the whole of the keychain is not getting clogged up. Uh, make sure every time that you stick something through there and just make sure that you've still got that hole inside your keychain. Okay, after two coats on the back and a coat on the front, it's time to add the chain and the key ring. I just used a pair of pliers and opened up the ring. Then I took my little key fob piece, the circle, and slid it on. Then just lay the chain over. And then I just took a second little pair of pliers and closed up the ring, twisted them together, and then clamp them together as tightly as possible. All right, that's it. That's as easy as it gets. Hey, any comments or questions, please leave them in the box below and I will get back to you on that. 
Have a wonderful week. And if you decide to make this project, enjoy because it is a lot of fun. Hey, have a great week. I'll catch up with you in the next video. Bye.